Hello, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whenever you're watching this. Put new stickers on my book. I want to tell you, this morning I got up at 4.15. I had to get up at 4.15. I got up at 4.35. Snooze, snooze, snooze. 4.35, got to get up. Took a shower last night before I went to bed. Got up and I washed off my important parts. Got dressed, got out there, and went to the gym. So I got a free trial for a week, and it's like a boot camp. They call it a class, but it's a boot camp. And they catered things to my needs. Um, I wasn't expected to go above and beyond. I wasn't expected. I was expected to go to what I could push myself to, and that's what I did. And it felt amazing. Number one, I got to see things that, I wasn't sure if I could do or not. Um, they have these rings and you do shit like that. And when I saw him demonstrating it, I was like, how embarrassing that I have to do this in front of everyone because I don't think I could do it. I have to pull up my own weight. I have to whatever you have to. Oh, my goodness. I didn't think I was going to be able to do it. But I did. And I stood there, and while well, everyone else was doing these shaky things on the chin-up bars, I don't even know what shit's called. I was with the rings doing it, and I was like, yeah. I felt amazing because I was 100% sure I couldn't do it. I had no faith in myself. And I stepped in there, and I saw all these fit bodies and thought, what? Like, why are you doing this to yourself, Jennifer? Why are you... Why? Why are you setting yourself up to feel bad? Like, I've always, my whole life, sabotaged myself because I felt like I was not worthy. And I went in there and I was like, why are you doing it again? But I wasn't. I was pushing through my fear. I was showing myself my limitations are not what I think they are. And in all reality... I have no limitations. I mean, of course, physically, I, there's so much I can't do. And that's just because of my physical aspect of my body. Um, you know, metal rods and missing toes and whatever. But mentally, I can push through. And no, I can't jump on those wiggly bars and, and whatever. But I can do what I can do. And I did it. And I proved it to myself and I came home and I felt amazing. I made my food the way I'm supposed to. I'm on Weight Watchers. I'm on WW. Not Weight Watchers. And um, I, I ate what I planned, which is one of the big things in my routines and my goals is to actually eat what I plan and eat what I make. Because a lot of times I have the meal plan up, whatever else, and I take time to plan, um, to make sure that it's something that there's an aspect of the dinner that everybody likes. If it's a meat dinner, I make myself a special, it's always a meat dinner, but like if it's like mainly meat, like chicken cutlets and whatever, I make sure that I have something on the side for me to eat because I don't really like that. Um... Although, buffalo chicken dip is the shit. Anyway. Um, anyway. So, I, I kept to it. I even go food shopping according to this list. I make a list. It's, um, I'm going to put it in my link tree. It's like a thing, a meal. It's like the, your meal. And then on the side, you can rip it off. You write your shopping list and you rip it off. Sticks to the refrigerator, although my magnet fell apart. But it could be that. I grabbed it too excitedly. I don't know. So I, I really take time to plan things out. And I will say 70% of the time I follow through with the dinners and breakfast and the lunch on what I had there. And sometimes I will say for like my breakfast and lunch, it's just an idea in case I don't know what to have. So I'm not picking. So it's a suggestion. And this morning, I came home, I had my eggs, my English muffin, I had my banana because 
Um, it's a zero point food and I love it and it's filling and I need to take less insulin with this whole meal. And I feel like I know that it's only 829 in the morning. I got my kid to school on time. Like what? Who am I? Who am I? Anyway, I just wanted to share that because I am super proud of myself. Why can I never find the stop button? I try to make it like seamless like other people, but I never do.